In our next example of how to correct nearsightedness, we have a person here who has a far point of 25 centimeters. A far point is the farthest point that this person can see clearly. Now, 25 centimeters is only 10 inches. So that means that anything past 10 inches begins to look very uh, fuzzy, not very focused. And anything within 10 inches, the person can see clearly. That's obviously a problem if you want to see things clearly far away. So how do you correct for that? Well, we're going, to use, we're going to give that person some diverging lenses, which causes an image to occur at the far point. So you want the image to be right there. There's your image. Of course, it'll be a virtual image because it's in front of the lens, which means the image distance is a negative distance, which has to be a negative 25 centimeters. So if the object is far away, so for example, object distance is at infinity, that means that S prime has to be a minus 25 centimeters, minus again because it's in front of the lens. Using our lens equation, we have 1 over F equals 1 over S plus 1 over S prime. S is infinity, so 1 over F is equal to 1 over infinity plus 1 over a minus 25. Of course, 1 over infinity, that is 0. Anything divided by infinity is always 0. So we have 1 over F is equal to minus 1 over 25. So if we then invert this equation, we get F is equal to minus 25. And of course, that's centimeters because we indicated the image distance in centimeters. Now, we don't go to the store and find glasses that say the focal length is minus 25 centimeters. We want to find the diopters or the power of the lens. And the power of any lens is defined as 1 over the focal length if the focal length is expressed in meters, which means we want to convert this to meters. So F is equal to 0 0.25 meters. We plug that into our equation right here, and the power of the lens is equal to 1 over 0 0.25 meters. And of course, uh, that would be negative because it's a diverging lens, so that's negative. And so that means that the power is equal to a negative 4, and the units for power is diopters. So that means you need to go to the store and find yourself a pair of glasses that are indicated to be minus 4 diopters. And then if you put those on and you have a, a far point that's 25 centimeters, you will see things clearly. Of course, the problem may come in if your two eyes don't have the same far point. If one has a far point of 25 centimeters, the other one has a far point of 50 centimeters, then of course you need to go to the optometrist and, and get specific glasses made for you so that the two lenses will be different. I don't think there's too many stores in there that give combinations of lenses for the left and the right eye. That would be too difficult. Uh, so typically when you buy something at the drugstore or Walmart, something like that, you both lenses will have the same power or the same diopters.